I'm afraid I, I could get in big trouble for that. It's possible Even somebody if it's fake. takes that the wrong way. Yeah, it's possible someone takes this the wrong way. <laughs> <laughs> What's going on? I am Matthias, and welcome to 10 Strange Amazon Products that Tanner here picked out, found on Amazon.com. Yeah, I did. Woo! Yeah, he did. Yeah, that's all there is to it, really. No, I'm gonna tell you whether it's an enjoy it or a destroy it. And to all you kids that say I should donate all the destroyed items instead of destroying it, I'm not gonna! Why would I donate some crappy things? Some half-used things that I don't even deem worthy of anything? <laughs> Why would you suggest that I donate that? Why wouldn't you suggest that I donate the good stuff? You guys are cruel. Anyways, let's begin. <laughs> Rustic leather pint sleeve with handle handmade by hand, but oof. <laughs> Get a grip on reality. Let's bring it back. Oh! By hide and drink. It's just not words that you put together. Oh wait, so it's just the sleeve. It's not, it doesn't come with the, yeah, you teach that leather. <laughs> <laughs> it's just, uh, it doesn't come with the actual glass? No, I don't think so. Well, that's disappointing. What if I don't have a glass that fits it? Why are you buying a glass sleeve if you don't got a glass? True. Can't come up with a reason. <laughs> you just got super deep into thought. You're like, there's gotta can't, be a reason. Can't come up with a reason. But this looks incredible. You know what's funny? Did you see what Paul got me for Christmas? It was like a Norris horn that you drink beer out of. That's what it was, <laughs> yes. Norris? <laughs> what did I say? Norris. <laughs> I knew exactly what you meant. It's Miss Norris. <laughs> it's, it's her horn. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, add to cart. Oh, oh, look, a glass. Yeah, it didn't come with it, but. Look, this is actually made seemingly well. <laughs> All right, look at this. This is nice. My only thought process here is like, why? Is it really that bad of an option to just like, just hold the glass? Or are you trying to like keep the glass warm? Is that what it does? I should have read the description a little bit more, but it came with like a little card here. That, oh, I almost <laughs> dropped it right in the drink, dude. My story began when I came to La Antigua. Guatemala. Brian? <laughs> <laughs> With a guitar on my back and enough money in my pocket to buy a pair of boots, word of mouth led me to the nearby leather producing town. I'm blessed to follow my passion. I encourage you to get out, see the world, and cultivate the ideas that inspire you. Like, why couldn't Brian be a Guatemalan like this? You know what I'm saying? Yeah, that's a cool Guatemalan. This is a really cool Guatemalan, you Brian's know? a normal Guatemalan. Gua Guayan. <laughs> Guayan. Yeah, Guayan's a real- Did I say Guayan? No, I said oh. Guayan. <laughs> there you go. That's it. God, this is hard to listen to. Did you just shotgun that? That was vodka. <laughs> <laughs> just notice it after. <laughs> like, you notice it like the first sip. You'd be like, oh! All right, I'll try this one. Oh, crap. What is this? It's oh. The crotch. All right, let's see if this works. Really, dude? That's what you want me to do? Yeah. No, no, you don't drink out of a can, okay? A can is just the container to hold the liquid, all right? You drink out of glass. All right, you ready? I can't do that. That's way too much. So I rate that one and enjoy it. Woo. Cheers to all of my Nordic friends and to no one else. <laughs> yeah, I'm Nordic. Are you? Yeah, I already went over this. Cheers, dude. Thanks, bud. I'm proud to be white. Am I not allowed to be? No, Why is allowed. that such an evil thing? Yeah, you're allowed to be. Be man. proud to be who you are, even if you're white. You can keep that in the video. Pongo portable table tennis set. <laughs> I thought that said Smurf Blue. <laughs> So Pongo Portable. So this is the people that are addicted to ping pong. Paddles have retractable handles for compact storage. Balls are stored inside net posts. Ooh, that what they call it? That's gotta hurt. <laughs> Four and a half stars. That's a lot of stars. That's almost all the stars. Is there a place to order replacement balls? Are you kidding me? Someone's just like never heard of ping pong before. No, it's a specific type of ball. You have to buy ours. My table is two inches thick. Nice. I can agree with that. Will it attach correctly? <laughs> <laughs> Add to cart. All right, here we go. Let's set this up, Tanner, and then let's see who's the real winner. Are you good at ping pong? Yeah, I'm really good at ping pong. I already beat Joey. That makes you've, sense. Ar you've already beat Joey? Yeah. Okay, so let's figure out who else I can play then. <laughs> I guess that's how that works. I don't know about that, dude. Have yeah. you ever played on a regulation ping pong table? Uh, on this size of a regulation ping pong table? This no. is regulation for five-year-olds. Uh, <laughs> I've never played when I was a five-year-old, so. <laughs> okay. Is it just me, or is this actually a really bad ping pong? No, these are terrible ping pongs. Is it the table or the ping pong? I don't know, it just doesn't sound right. It's this too. Yeah, this sucks. This is really bad. Even for someone who's like played ping pong four times in his entire life, I'm like, immediately hit that and I was like, I don't like that. <laughs> it's just hollow. Mm -hmm. Uh, I got a ball. You know, instead of dope or nope, we should just play ping pong and I'll beat you with that. <laughs> Why? Because I can't beat you in any of the motorcycles. Oh, I can beat you in yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, well those are real life things. So, uh, oh, yes! You got okay. me laughing! <laughs> <laughs> oh, dude, you jammed me. 
Maybe it's the size of the table. But look, I mean, this can this be made longer? Uh... <laughs> Why? Why does it need to be so? <laughs> Why does he keep going? <laughs> Now how do you put it away? You just uh, roll it up like this? Yeah, call fruit by the foot. Fruit by the foot? <laughs> fruit by six foot. Okay, is that it? That's it. But you stick the balls in there, and then you put this like that or something, and then it's like portable. I mean, if you're obsessed with ping pong, you may want to travel around with this, but then again, if you're obsessed with ping pong, you wouldn't want to travel around with this. It really solves no issue because the avid ping pong players that want a portable set will just carry around a net and tie it to something with an actual ping pong, a good paddle. DESTROY IT! NO! Ah! <laughs> you're just leaving footprints on it. Yeah, dude, that's pretty tough. Ah! Didn't I thought work. you were supposed to be a professional at breaking. Yeah, it's strong. Check this out. Ah! Oh! <laughs> dude, you got a hard head. <laughs> dude, I'm crazy strong head, dude. The Freebird Mullet Wig Skull Cap. Skull Cap? Oh, does it come with the hair? Oh, <laughs> it's got to come with the hair. I legitimately thought this dude just had that hair. Is he wearing braces? Good for him, dude. <laughs> <laughs> Trying to improve himself later on in life. Constant vigilance. That's how you stay attractive, men and ladies. Also that. I'm always gonna call my hats from now on skull caps. Hey babe, can you give me my skull cap? <laughs> <laughs> Add to cart. Mullet on the go. <laughs> I hate fake hair. It always gets in my mouth. True. Where do you put the fake hair? <laughs> Alright, here we go guys. This is it. Oh god. <laughs> who do you look like? Now oh. I look like what my soul looks like. <laughs> <laughs> you look like a guy who rides a Harley Davidson. So what? Eh? What's your favorite meal? Grits. <laughs> <laughs> What's your favorite drink? Anything with barley in it. <laughs> Ask me some more questions, the rainbow. How long did it take you to grow out that hair? I forged this hair in the depths of my mother's basement. <laughs> What's your name? Jilly Bib Bob. <laughs> Jilly Bib Bob. Jilly. You ever go bowling? Bowling. I don't grab balls. <laughs> oh, this itches so much. Ah! Oh, dude, that itches so much. Look, my forehead's so red. I have to rate this a enjoy it. I want to see Tanner with it on now. Hey, what's going on, pretty lady? I feel like I look like Post Malone. <laughs> Post Malone, what do you think, dude? You think that looks like you, bro? Man, let's get weird, you know what I'm saying? Let's go. Oh, I look like Kid you need, Rock. You need the little bangs. Yeah, I need the bangs. And That's some what I'm missing. Face tattoos. <laughs> <laughs> he's got those, right? Yeah, he's got like barbed wire across his nice, forehead. Nice, dude. Men's black leather money belt, sizes 32 through 56. What the heck, Tanner? You think I'm a 56? Yeah. <laughs> what the heck? I've seen those thighs. My thighs? Itch. <laughs> <laughs> uh, leather money belt by Leather Boss is 1.25 inches wide and can be worn with dress or casual pants. Can be worn with dress, that's casual. Genuine leather money belt features hidden interior zipper and chrome buckle. Wow, interior zipper. You gotta be like really, really paranoid. You know? Super paranoid. You gotta be so paranoid. Let's try it out, add to cart. Wow, this looks primo. I actually do need another belt. Really? Yeah. Perfect timing. But <laughs> I'm just afraid 32 through 56. I'm just afraid it's a little bit too big for me. In case y'all need to know, I am 32. But I also am six foot tall, no matter how many giants I hire. Everyone thinks I'm tiny because I'm next to all these giants. You know, mm -hmm. Connor's a giant in width. You're a giant in height. <laughs> a giant in width. Dude, have you seen <laughs> his- <laughs> <laughs> No, dude, his shoulders. He's so broad. No shame, Connor. What the heck? Why can't I get- oh, Thank you. Okay, so where is- There it is, right there. Whoa! It is a long zipper. Why? In this zipper, you can fit maybe cash, maybe the drugs. Let's try both. I mean, yeah. let's try something. Oh yeah, I won't bring the other- Stuff. So what are these? Let's see if we can fit those in. Is this where you go to eat? I mean, <laughs> shop? That's not gonna fit, it's already wider. Well, what if I wanted to use a gift card? <laughs> <laughs> You're just so paranoid that someone's gonna steal your juice it up gift card, dude. <laughs> Who's got an H&M credit card, bro? You love H&M that much. I actually have one in my pocket. Dude, but yours is even next level. His is like metallic. Stand up. You want this look? Model, do a little modeling pose. You want this look, guys? That's H&M, not sponsored. What, what's the matter? What are you doing? I actually found the drugs. I seem to have lost the drugs. 
I took them. You took mine? <laughs> I was looking for those for like 20 minutes. I was like, I swear I put them down. 20 minutes? I took them two minutes ago. See if you can fit some of the candy in there. I can do that, I think. You're gonna wear a snack, you look like a snack. That's really thick. It's like, oh, that got moved. Look at that. It's like moving with it. There we go. I don't know. You'd feel it. You'd really feel it. The drugs aren't gonna work for it, sugar or not. I'm gonna stay and uh, destroy it. Oh, God. All right, Tanner. <laughs> I knew you were gonna do it. I was like, oh, no. I can't really destroy a belt. What? Genuine leather. Yeah, dude. Prank stuff. Prank and gags. Snake in a can of nuts. <laughs> Wait, what? Snake and nuts, dude? Is this what you bought? <laughs> I thought it said sneak in a can of nuts. Prank kit by Funny Party Hats. You think we can get anyone with this? No. I mean, this is the age old gag. You've seen this in a thousand shows, but I still think people wouldn't expect it. Like, I think Paul or Connor would not expect this. Really? I think they'd actually expect me to be like, try this weird food. Oh, you're right. It's Add the card. Just did that. Here we go. That is so weak. What the heck, dude? It's all like faded and stuff. This is how it came? Like, are you kidding me right now? That is sad, dude. I don't think this is gonna fool anyone. If it looked like the picture, maybe. But this, I don't, let's find out. Let's see if it fools anyone. What's up? What you doing? I'm on LinkedIn. Nice. Do you wanna try these crazy nuts? Yeah, dude. Dude, they're so nasty. Try it. They're so nasty. <laughs> that was so disappointing. I thought it was gonna like launch out. <laughs> so how, how'd you remember that this is a gag? Because that gag has been around since. No, but I was hoping you, you was were born. a young kid and he would have forgotten it, <laughs> or maybe before his time. <laughs> no, 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 no. It's just food. no. It's, it's not food. No, it's, it's not. not. It's not. It's, it's not. food. It's not. Where's my drinks? I need to cover my drink cups, dude. Yeah, it's I'm just food. Nope. Try no. some nuts. No! I'm allergic. Really? No. <laughs> <laughs> try some nuts. I don't want... Come on, dude. Why are you holding it like that, though? You're like... Try some nuts, dude. Oh, jeez. <laughs> it's gonna just be a... No, it's thing. not! <laughs> dude, just... Why won't you believe me? Here. <laughs> the oldest prank in the book, and he was still like, he was expecting well, I, I, I a food. I literally said it too. I was like, there's gonna be a snake. I don't know. Ah. He was still like, oh. <laughs> all right, you can keep that. <laughs> Before we get into that next product, shout out to Flower King. Yes, that's right. There's a king of flowers. Thank you for being part of that notification squad, clicking that bell icon, and subscribing and commenting down below within the first 30 minutes. If there's a king, it's you. Thank you. Next product. Ew! Dad bag 3D beer belly waist pocket funny gag gifts. Oh, I hate skin with hair on things. <laughs> <What>? <laughs> I've seen shirts with skin and hair, like the hairy back shirt. I've seen I, I've seen thousands of products. You know what I mean? I've been doing this for a year or so. Yeah, you know, as far as a beer belly goes, I wish it had a use other than making you look bad. Because if I could store things in my belly, then there'd be an excuse for it to be so big. Look at this horrible Photoshop. Like, what is happening here? He's gotta put his phone in his fanny pack and like, he's doing what? He's like splashing it up with some kids? Like, what's happening? I don't know. Waterproof poo. <laughs> <laughs> Add to cart. Oh, this is just so upsetting. No one's belly button's that big. Look how, how big my hand is. I have a big hand. Ew, it's so ugly. <laughs> There's just nothing unsettling about this. <laughs> I would, I wanna like, take this around the office and be like, <laughs> like that, but I, I'm afraid I, I could get in big trouble for that. It's possible Even somebody if it's fake. takes that the wrong way. Yeah, yeah, it's possible someone takes this the wrong way. <laughs> <laughs> so you do it to all the viewers. Anyway. Yeah, I'll do it to the viewers. They don't get a say. You can't report me on the internet. Oh man, I have to say that this is an absolute destroyer, but I'm not gonna destroy it. I'm gonna force Tanner to walk around with it in real life, not even in this video. <laughs> Just in real life. <laughs> Next product, new boogie box. Change your child's booger picking and flicking habit. Use the boogie box to teach your child to store the boogers for disposal instead of flicking them everywhere. Oh my god. This is the worst thing I've ever seen in my life. Oh, you store your boogers in it? Yes, dude! Oh, no! <laughs> okay, so the idea is, is that your kids are walking around, picking their nose, and then flicking their boogers, and as a parent you walk around and you're like, why are there boogers everywhere? I'm just like trying to imagine the issue here. Kids, just eat them. That's the correct answer. Oh, kid. you're gonna make me throw up. <laughs> Because the idea here is that like, what do you do? Are you supposed to wash this? Do you put this in your dishwasher? You open it up just to see if your kid's been doing it? Oh, great, it's a mountain of boogers. <laughs> so happy. Could you
you imagine like picking your nose and then like after the first one you put it in there are you you're just continually putting them in there mm -hmm. and like you're just feeling all the old oh I, I feel like I'm gonna get be sick you gotta formulate a block of cheese kind of mentality you know, oh you my just, I, I feel like I'm gonna be sick you put it into a block stop you cut it stop 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 <laughs> stop are there any reviews no no reviews big shock add the cart we got to add the cart oh this is it man the one. Oh, it's so small. I thought it was bigger. Stores your boogers. Hide boogers right under their nose. Your nose, you pick, your finger, you hide, your boogie box. Oh my gosh. Warning, boogers should not be consumed under any circumstances. That's just gross. Dude, that changed your life right there, dude? That's just gross. That's just gross. Collecting them, okay. <laughs> Here we go, guys. Oh my gosh, that is disgusting. So you just go in there and then you just like Peel it off your finger like that. Honestly, if my kid used this, I would ground them. Kind of looks like your nose a little bit. Yeah, it does. Absolutely, it does look like my nose, just three times bigger. Oh, I was gonna say smaller. Yeah. Well, it's all perspective. <laughs> <laughs> this one is a destroy. Dude, this is hard. <laughs> That'll do it. <laughs> Star Wars Furbaka. This is when marketing goes too far. Furby. Furby. Yes, it's a Furby. Interactive toy reacts to motion and touch. What's the age range for a toy like this? Because I remember Furbies came out. When I was young, they came out, and I was also like, that's really dumb. I just never was a fan of the kitschy stuff. I was always like a fan of like the stuff that was like more realistic or practical. like- Practical. Yeah, more practical, you know? If you're gonna go Star Wars merch, you know, you'd want like the telescoping lightsaber because then you can actually like play with it. You can play with this, I guess, but it's like, this wasn't in the movie. I don't know. I just, I can't get on board with it. Six years and up. Okay, so still not really understanding. There's a little video here. Let's watch this. It's Furbaka oh, from yeah. Hasbro. Furbaka makes Wookiee sounds like his favorite Star Wars character, Chewbacca. Okay, I've seen enough. That's upsetting. Add to cart. Why didn't they just make a little Furby Ewok? Yeah, right? Because the Ewoks aren't in the latest movies, so kids probably don't know who they are. Oh my gosh, no, they do not. They have a Yoda one. They have a Darth Vader one. Wow, this is heavy. Oh my gosh, this booklet. Is it a poster? Oh, okay. I was gonna say, there can't be this much to know about a Furby. No, I lied, there is. There is that much to know about a Furby. Hello. Who actually liked Furbies? I wanna know that type of person. Do you know anyone that actually had Furbies? My sister did. And she liked it. I don't know. I don't know if she has any special affinity towards them. Hello, may the force be with you. Are you from the dark side? Oh no, this battery's in wrong. Yep, there we go. Not the one that I put in. Must have been my fault. Really? Not while I'm servicing you. <laughs> <laughs> Try tickling him. Where? It's everywhere. I just don't want to though. In the belly, just tickle the belly a little bit. Did I put him to sleep? Yeah, yeah, do another one, do another one. Oh, he's already sleeping. Oh my gosh, he doesn't shut up. Oh, it's because you have him up sideways, I think. That wouldn't wake you up? I feel like that would wake me up. Someone's coming up and smacking me in the face. Now he's falling in love with me. Can you blame him? Turn for Baca upside down. Oh, jeez, that was loud. What are you doing? Speak to Furbaka. Furbaka, why do you exist? Pull and hold tail for 10 seconds to make Furbaka sleep. Oh. Did he just fart? Did you hear that sound? Yeah, definitely, it likes it. I don't like that. Introduce Furbaka to others. Hey Tanner, here's my Furbaka. Hey Burfaka. Would you like to have him forever? Do I have to? What's the last thing on here? Destroy Furbaka. Oh. I don't even care that it can connect to an app. I'm just gonna give it a lobotomy. This <laughs> is <laughs> so messed up. He's intense, dude. Dude, this thing is made well. Props to the makers. I would say this one thing, all right? Hasbro, spend your time making better things. <laughs> I like almost everything else you make. Just an off button would be fantastic. You know what? I'm not even gonna destroy this on the spot right now. I'm gonna send this to a much worse fate. I'm gonna give it to Wrecked. Yeah, it's gonna die. Yeah, <laughs> It's gonna die big time, all right? So guys, subscribe to Wrecked right there. It's a channel where we literally just destroy stuff. Here you go, Tanner. Original limited edition white Skittles. Fruits white imported. What do you think that 
that taste like? Uh, White Skittles. Privilege? <laughs> I was trying to think of a good joke, but you beat me to it. No, actually, this is actually really interesting. I wonder if the process of making white Skittles, uh, this isn't a joke, I'm actually curious. <laughs> I wonder if it's like less steps or more steps, you know? Because white people always equate with like, oh, that's blank. It's undone, it's unfinished, you know, like a white box. It's like no one printed on it. But this, they could have potentially had to go through more work just to make it white. Chewy candies and a crisp sugar shell with fruit flavors. <gasps> Are they all white with different flavors? Mm, that's interesting. Do you think we could figure out what's what? I had the card. <laughs> Wow, almost $8 for some white Skittles, dude. Give the rainbow, taste the rainbow, but it's white. There's no rainbow and I can't taste anything. So I, will it taste like sadness? Okay, no, there are. All the lentils are white in celebration of pride. What? It says that right there. <laughs> Wait, what? In celebration of pride. Skittles, all right, dude, respect. They're proud to be white too. It's okay to be proud to be the race that you are. Just because I'm proud to be white doesn't mean it's not okay for you to be proud to be whatever you are. <laughs> I love you all equally, but I'm also proud to be who I am. And that's okay, no matter what your teachers tell you. You wanna taste it? Wanna taste that invisible rainbow? <laughs> all right, look at that. White Skittles. You think I was lying to you? All white Skittles. Let's see if you can detect. One. Color plays a huge role in taste though, in perception. You know? It identifies. Mm -hmm. hmm. No idea. I don't know. Lime? Lemon? Grape or something? I... I'm gonna guess lemon. Lime. Mine was lime. I'm gonna guess blackcurrant or strawberry on mine. By the way, blackcurrant is a flavor in the UK, in Starburst and Skittles. Mm -hmm. So much better than grape. No idea. I got the exact same flavor twice. <laughs> That's what you think. Orange. That's orange. Hey. This is a bizarre experience. That's black room. I don't know. <laughs> it's so triggering. This Strawberry is sweet. so difficult. And there's no way we'll ever know. That's what the worst thing is. Can't figure it out. I'm about to say enjoy it though. Soul Skate 3 Wheel Skateboard of the Future. So cool. <laughs> Promotes good health as well as social skills. No, it does nope. not. <laughs> I will take a wager that it does not promote social skills. Good health, possibly. You know, because it'll get you moving around, but it'll get you moving around and then everyone will move away. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, come on, let's be real. It's an awkward looking funky thing, but let's test it out. 30 bucks, not too crazy, add to cart. All right, here you go. The soul skate is perfect for your mobile lifestyle. <laughs> oh, you're supposed to put two feet on one? How? Look at these little pictures right there. How are they doing that? Oh, and you can put it in your backpack like that. All right. Let's Let's take it outside, see what we can do with it, tan man. That makes it feel good. <laughs> <laughs> You're like, what? Are you kidding me? That's probably how it steers, but still a little disconcerting, you know? Hey, uh, let's just have a loose axle. That's how it'll steer. <laughs> let's go. No, wait, wait, Connor. Have you ever seen one of these before? I used to have something similar to it. Do you, can you teach me how to ride it? It's, I mean. So you don't need a helmet, I'll take the helmet. <laughs> okay, it's pretty simple. I mean, you just one foot it. Ow, what the heck? Then... What is this, made for children? Yeah, and it's just like ice skating. Oh, you go forward that way? What's this thing? I don't know, what is it? Oh, it's a brake. You just didn't have that, huh? No, mine was dangerous. Mine had like a foot strap and everything. It was A foot good. strap? Yeah. <laughs> All right, let's see if I can do this. You do it like an ice skate. No, I think. <laughs> what the heck? Okay, okay, <laughs> I was pressing the brake. No, that's a safety release. Is it? Oh yeah, you need to step on it to actually go. What the no, heck? No, 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 no. Oh! Put, put your other no, not again! <laughs> Did you roast the carpet? Dude, you're roasting the carpet. <laughs> yeah, you need to step on it. Yeah, you need to step on it to unlock it. But that's what I was doing. That's what I thought I was doing. There we go. There you go. Hey, dude, you're doing it. You cannot steer. Do it one footed. Okay, so I gotta go a little bit on the side. There we go. There you go, yeah. Now, I guide like this? Yeah, kind of, yeah. But use your right foot to guide it, see? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Oh. Oh, look at you, bro. Dude, you're cruising. Yeah, dude. <laughs> Not good. I mean, I think you can absolutely get this to work. It's just at what cost? Like, write a skateboard, nerd. I'm, <laughs> I'm gonna rate this one because it's so cheap. Way cheaper than a skateboard. I'll rate it and enjoy it. That video right there. Earwax, supposed to remove earwax. And it's quite interesting, so click that video right there. This video over here, uh, well, I'll just say even people not prone to seizures could definitely get seizures using this device. It's crazy. So click one of those videos, and if you're new here, click subscribe, and we'll see you next time. High five.